this demonstration will show some of the benefits of a partially automated truck platoon utilizing cooperative adaptive cruise control technology for heavy trucks. This demonstration will provide an opportunity for visitors to experience a short ride on a heavy truck along the I-110 freeway near the Los Angeles and Long Beach Port Complex. Visitors will ride in the second and third trucks and will experience firsthand the use of Cooperative Adaptive Cruise Control, or CACC. CACC is an enhancement of Adaptive Cruise Control, or ACC. Cooperative Adaptive Cruise Control provides closer and more accurate control of the gap and speed difference between the trucks than conventional adaptive cruise control. The CACC system uses forward-looking radar sensors and electronic actuation of engine and brakes of the conventional adaptive cruise control system. The Cooperative Adaptive Cruise Control System adds Dedicated Short Range Communications, or DSRC. This vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle communication enabling the implementation of a higher performance vehicle following controller. Some of the benefits of the Cooperative Cruise Control System enables heavy trucks to drive in a closer than normal formation with automatic control of their speed and spacing. Drivers continue to control the steering and remain vigilant for any hazards in the driving environment. This adaptive system can improve traffic stability. The more stable vehicle following trucks respond in a unit rather than individually, and this reduces the accordion effect. It also increases lane capacity. Shorter gaps between trucks will increase the capacity of the lane and smooth out and reduce but not eliminate traffic disturbances such as cut-ins, reducing traffic congestion. Reduced aerodynamic drag enables energy savings and greenhouse gas reductions by reducing fuel usage and emissions from the stable following and drag reductions caused by the trailer configuration. This demonstration was implemented by the PATH program of the University of California, Berkeley and the Volvo Group under the sponsorship of the FHWA Exploratory Advanced Research Program and Caltrans.